I also speak with to myself and do these auto suggestions. Um, and I also, as I said, I think I, I mentioned it right now. I um, I read your book aloud. I am now also. Uh, I also bought a few days ago the book about self-hypnosis of Melvin Powers, and I'm now um, I'm now getting to to well to get into hypnosis, and I, and I think it's quite uh, and and I think it's doing me a lot of of good, and that's that's all that I'm doing right now. I think my speech has improved a lot. I think it has improved a lot. The the email you uh, sent me with all these um, documents about the starter kit, uh, it 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 it's been a, a lot of. I mean, it 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 it's made a lot of good to me. Yeah, I would. Uh, well, I've I've seen. Uh, and change which I would consider an improvement, which is that with my very close, close friends and a family, with my with my brother, and, uh, uh, the, with my mother and my father, I now almost don't stutter. For example, uh, today I have a, a zero uh, incidents, and these last days I, I I got your email about one of the your PWS. And you do, and you did a Skype like we are doing now, and you were speaking also that you were advising this guy to to keep it short, and as you are saying now to uh, to um, insert some pauses of one or two seconds between each thought, and yeah. that and and I've been doing that for a few days, and I actually enjoyed. And, and, and doing this, I enjoy my speech a lot more. I enjoy talking. Yeah. I hmm. love it. Uh, what specifically, why has your speech gotten better? What What have you done that's made it better? Well, uh, first of all, um, I saw a light at the end of the tunnel, as, as I could say, because I, until I... Until I knew about about your book, I didn't know that there was a solution to stuttering. So I almost had like assumed that I would speak like I did for the rest of my life. And well, I accepted it until a friend of mine, um, Jorge, he told me about this book and. I, so I bought it, and I started reading it, and um, yeah, I started reading it. I saw that you were a stutterer, so you were not a psychologist or psych psychiatrist or that, that uh, spoke about this in a, let's call it scientific way or, or medical way, but didn't know the way to cure it or... So I thought that if you made it, I could make it as well. So I started reading it. I started to be to try to be disciplined with with all the instructions you mentioned in the book. So it's been uh, uh, so a big part of the progress I've made is because of discipline uh, about about. Uh, Every day doing the auto suggestions or auto hypnosis, no matter the plans that I had for that day, I had to do it. And reading aloud, it it helped me a lot. So it's all about hearing fluent. One thing that surprised me, for example, yesterday, I went with my girlfriend and some friends to a restaurant and to have dinner. And when I was speaking, one of my friends told me, wow, it's amazing uh, how good you speak and how good you pronounce things. I was like, well, I didn't think about it, but yeah. <laughs> Do you love that? Yeah, of course. My aunt called me to, 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 to tell me all this, to call me and to, and, to, and to give me the happy birthday and all this. And I think I, I haven't seen her for over a year, 
So, so of course, we haven't seen each other, and she, and 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 we've been speaking for like 20 minutes, and she was amazed with my improvement, and and we've been speaking about it, and, and I told her, I feel like a complete different person, and it's because what we are speaking about that you have control over your mind and that's and maybe well for sure in the past if I felt for example anger or anxiety or, or any similar feeling this was the dominant one and I and I didn't have any control over that and now I, I, I have it yeah today we have speaking Javier Valcazar Cortazar. What a beautiful name. Thank you. <laughs> uh, he is a realtor in Madrid, Spain, and a PWSS. He stuttered badly. He no longer does. And a highly accomplished certified speech coach. His topic today is overcoming fear. Javier, the mic is yours. Thank you, Lee. Okay, so... For today's talk, I wanted to speak about fears because on because on these meetings we are a lot of PWSS. So I so so to become a PWSS means that we have stopped stuttering, but not that we, but not necessarily that we don't have fears and start a threat. So I became a, a PWSS on April of last year, and. I must say that since then, my speech has been improving, I would say, week after week. And since, since, since I became a, a PWSS, I, I, I would say that I, I haven't appeared as speech disabled since then. But of course, as I said before, this doesn't mean that I haven't had any threats or stutter peers. I think that Frank Caprio wrote some words that, that, that I think we should never forget, which are, we have free choice to accept or reject thoughts. Nothing compels us to think anything except our own desires. So use your mental switch to dictate your thoughts. Believe that you can improve and you will.